What's up guys, this is iPhones and iPods, and in this video today, this exciting video, I'll be showing you how to jailbreak your um, 3G iPhone, your first generation iPhone, and your first generation iPod Touch on a Mac or Windows computer. Now this is very simple, and I've, I'm going to try to make this as simple as possible. It can't get really much any easier than this. Alright, first step. In the, link, in the description, I have about seven links as I just have right here. Each one is for a specific device, for instance your first generation iPhone, your 3G iPhone, or your iPod Touch. If you would like your first generation iPhone unlocked and jailbroken, you click that link obviously. If you want it unlocked and jailbroken, and what the Pwned Apple logo means is like when it's when your phone starts up, that's the uh, logo that comes up, not the Apple. And um, yeah. If you just want it just jailbroken and you just you don't want it unlocked, then you just click these other ones. Same as follows for the 3G, you cannot unlock it at the moment. And obviously the iPod Touch, jailbroken. So what you're going to do is, depending on what device you have, you're going to download one of these links and make sure you save it to the desktop. These links could take a while because firmwares are big packages. But once you have that done, you should get a uh, something like this. This is for my 3G. Once we have that, we need to make sure our device is connected into iTunes and iTunes into your computer. Like I said, Mac or Windows, it's all good. And we're going to open up iTunes. Now, before we do anything, we have to put our phone into DFU mode. Now, if you don't know how to do that, I have a video in the description to uh, my previous jailbreaking video for 3.1 firmware. It shows you how to do it, but I'll just give you a quick rundown if you don't know how to. What you do is you turn off your device, and it's going to take a while, but um, let me just let it finish real quick. And once it has uh, completely turned off, you hold the power button for five seconds. Once that five seconds is over, you hold the power and home button for ten seconds. Once that ten seconds is over, you release the power button you should still have a blank screen and in iTunes you should get a message saying that your phone or your iPod touch is in recovery mode this is the, t the step in which you can um, let me just plug in my phone really quickly this is the step in which you can actually upgrade your um, your firmware to the uh, 3.1 jailbroken as you can see mine is jailbroken because I do have the pineapple logo so let me just have um, iTunes recognize that my device is on real quick And if you guys have any questions, leave a comment below. Most of my viewers are very helpful if they are knowledgeable of jailbreaking and all that stuff. And if you have further questions, follow me on Twitter or hit me up with a message. Alright guys, so once your device has um, been su successfully put into DFU mode, and like I said before, if you don't know how to do that, link in the description. Once your device is in DFU mode and we're plugged into iTunes and you did get the message saying that your, your device is in recovery mode, this is the point where we actually start the jailbreaking process which is very simple now like I said before in these links you've downloaded a firmware and it should have gone on your desktop and all, all we have to do is restore your device with that custom firmware so what you're going to do is we're going to restore it but we're going to to um, pick the firmware we want we're going to press option for a Mac so option restore for a Mac and for a PC control restore so since I'm on a Mac I'm going to click just do it real quickly. Option restore. And now I get a list of like stuff I can pick. So I'm gonna pick my firmware. And then you click OK. You click choose. And this is where it's going to actually start restoring your firmware with restoring your device with a custom firmware that is already jailbroken. Now I have already um jailbroken my device, so I'm not gonna do that, but um it's just the same as any other restoring process and once you're done you can restore it back as a uh, a backup of what you had and the only other thing is that you will have Cydia and IC on there so it doesn't get any simpler than that it's just a restore but the restore also has the jailbroken stuff on it so um, I hope this tutorial helped you I hope it's as simple as possible I'll have everything in the description it should 
everything in the, in the description should pretty much cover this video. And if you don't know how to do this and you have a Mac, I have a link in the description to my other video. And so this is the uh, the jailbreak for your 3G iPhone, iPhone first generation unlocking two and iPod Touch, all on a Mac or PC. Like and um, when the 3GS iPhone jailbreak comes out and the second generation uh, iPod Touch jailbreak comes out, I will most definitely have a video on that. So stay tuned and don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Thanks, guys.